Many users say they love the convenience. It does have its shortfalls though, especially when it comes to security, leaving some people out of pocket. Tap and go. It's a simple concept, cutting time for consumers. Yeah, it's very convenient. It's good. It's actually convenient because you don't need to carry that much of cash with you along. It's just a lot quicker and easier. But that doesn't mean the technology is flawless. This technology based on RFID, radio frequency identification and near field communications, NFC, is a very vulnerable, risky solution that credit card companies have chosen. From skimming devices able to read card details from close proximity to lost or stolen cards being used by complete strangers, the safety concerns surrounding PayPass technology are valid. Money went missing out of my account. I had it all sorted with the bank, and next thing you know, two weeks later, the same thing happened again. Unfortunately, it's a story that gets told all too often. On Monday, a man lost his wallet at Albion Park, it ended up in the hands of a 41 year old who allegedly used the victim's debit cards via the Pay pass function on close to 30 occasions. The 41-year-old, who was known to police, was charged with 28 counts of fraud. Knowing where your card is at all times and checking your bank statements is essential. Like, I've got mine in one of those cards, like the card holder, so you can't scan it at all when you walk past. There are many people asking for the old magnetic stripe cards, and what they do is they keep the chip card at home and they use a magnetic stripe card for their credit card purchases. Anyone who loses their card or notices money missing from their account should contact their bank immediately. Tanya Dandrinos, Win News.